Hell yeah, what's up guys? This is Curse Pike. My friends call me Big C. Back in action today, I'm going to show you how to add camera shake to your videos. Let me just show you what I'm talking about first. You see that? That's a shake. This is not because the person holding the camera is shaking the lens. It's because we've added this in manually. This is a very commonly used technique. Uh, a production value enhancer for when you're showing confusion or excitement or frustration or if you just want to show organic camera movement what your what your uh, camera is on a tripod for example you want to show that movement here's how you do it before I show you any more I'll show you a little bit here from a Mr. Beast video you see this this is what it looks like when somebody's walking and they've got their camera on and it's shaking around very very common but I'm going to show you how to do that without having to do the holding the, the camera, just, just doing it naturally. So let's just go ahead and delete all of this here. So we'll start from the beginning and I will drag and drop in some footage here just like this. So I've got some, just is just stock footage of somebody playing a some sort of console thingy dingy and it's cool. All right, let's go. You'll see here as I scrub through it, there's no shake going on. It's just him playing it okay so let's just make it 13 seconds so it's not super long the next step here this is a quick tip in case you're not aware of this but i'm just going to lower the sound down because we're not really working with sound here we're just working on the shake or the camera movement the next step if you're work if you're following along you want to go to the effects panel over here and then unbelievably this is like one of the craziest naming conventions in the world but you actually need to go down let me just close up some stuff here you got to go to grunge and <laughs> no it's not like a 90s uh grunge band or like a nirvana concert um no you got to go to grunge and then when you go down you'll see something called shake alternatively you can just search here and you'll find shake so what you do is you left click on the shake effect drag and drop it on top of your video just like that when you do that, it gives you a default a bit of shake. So let me show you what it comes with them, uh, right out of the box. It's a very subtle kind of shake. It, it, that might be good enough if you just want to show a very subtle hand um, handheld look to your footage. But in most cases, you want to go a little bit more than that, especially if you're trying to do like a frustration or a confusion or a, oh my God, I'm so angry type look. What you want to do is I generally jack the, the amount up now let's just increase the amount to about 80 for now and then the speed let's go all the way up to about seven seven point two now watch what we got here i'm going to just move it to the beginning ah so frustrating and if you want to change that like big big movement you can go ahead and do that and if you want to keep it like on a tighter movement down here to just show a little bit but i mean i don't know somewhere around there looks pretty good that's good and again you can up the speed if you want to increase it let's try eight hey crazy <clears throat> excuse me but that is how you add hand movement how you add camera shake to a shot without any shake guys this is very very commonly used in high production value videos and because it's freedom and the way we do things here this is a free tool this is free software everything we do is free to make you the best video editor you know and it doesn't cost you a penny thanks for watching this tutorial Ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned. Be back soon.